Hello YouTube, this is Developers and Hackers again back now. Uh, today I am going to show you how to unroot Samsung Galaxy S4. Uh, and you need to be downloading a file uh, which is your official uh, ROM for Galaxy S4. In my case, I am using i9500, so I have downloaded the file. I will be giving the link in the description for your native uh, S4 and your country's uh, ROM and you'll be downloading those from sammobile.com and I'll be you should be having access to the files uh, so you need to get registered go ahead just register uh, and that's for free um, yeah go ahead and download the file uh, which is uh, for every S4 that should be 1.7 GB and after you download that just extract the file you'll be seeing these two files from there and whenever you extract those files uh, one is 2.45 GB and that's for me not for you your ROM may be different from mine and one point fine and this uh, this doesn't mean anything okay but just don't delete that just keep that that might be useful in other cases and you just need to download the Odin if you don't have Samsung drivers just uh, download the Kais uh, from samsung.com slash Kais and install those reboot and now open Odin yeah before that uh, before you open Odin just uh, go into download mode which is uh, volume down, power button, the home button. Uh, you'll be seeing a message and click the power uh, volume up button. You'll be seeing this. Uh, as I have already um, done this, uh, that means I have already flashed the normal ROM, so it says official. But uh, now just go ahead. Yes. This is a brief one, but I'm not going to flash now. If, don't worry, uh, this works. Uh, then click, you'll be seeing this com something. Uh, mine is com5. If you are in older versions uh, and using Odin version 3.03, .03, and if you are in older versions, uh, you'll be getting a yellow one there. Yellow one. And you should be checking only auto reboot and factory reset time okay and click on PDA choose the extracted file that means MD5 file uh, JK from the desktop yeah open that uh, this uh, says not responding but don't fear uh, as the file is so large, uh, this takes some time to recognize, and uh, that takes some time. Uh, so be patient. Yeah, there's a major issue in this. Uh, for some ROMs, uh, Samsung has a big bug in there uh, that if you flash some ROMs, uh, that might say fail in here. But uh, but just don't worry. Uh, reboot your system and. Uh, one second try. Uh, if this doesn't work, uh, there's a way. Just open Kais, uninstall, install it again, reboot it, and again uh, you need to select that PDA and flash it. That will definitely work for you. And uh, uh, now it's the the file is loading. The not responding means the file is being loading. Okay. Um, in the meanwhile. Uh, you should be uh, uh, that mean yeah the file is being loaded uh, as mine is uh, already official that mean I have already flashed the ROM uh, you just uh, after the after setting this all uh, you just need to click start uh, and I said uh, I before said that there is a big bug in there. Uh, that's nothing but Play Store doesn't work for some ROMs. Uh, not for all, 
um, for the current Indian ROM and uh, for Chinese I think so uh, these two ROMs uh, have play store bug just don't worry uh, after installing uh, just click start there uh, now I'm not gonna click start after clicking start uh, there will be a bar running over here all all the way long and your uh, S4 will, will reboot and uh, will flash something like Android will be coming here and down going button something like a blue color going one rolling one and that's it uh, after that if you see that official and you will be getting OD updates uh, click start button uh, but I'm not gonna click, click now please remember after selecting uh, once again I will be seeing the full process uh, click on PDA button choose the file click on open after you open that that takes some time to load uh, enter into download mode connect it to your PC uh, click start button uh, if that fails close this window once again uh, reboot your uh, that says if that fails uh, again uh, don't worry uh, there will be a message that Kai's uh, download into Kai's mode something like that just don't worry uh, power button volume down home button again you will be getting into download mode and again you should be doing this process uh, as actually I have failed two times to do this and the third time I have flashed so and I'm not gonna do it again because uh, that might be risky for me but not for you because you are already in risk uh, as you have rooted your S4 uh, this works for all versions GDN9500 and GDN9505 um, uh, now mine is octa-core variant which is GDN9500 mm, yes click start button I am not gonna click remember that and uh, after you do that uh, I said that you will be entered into recovery mode something don't do this okay I mean just flash that you'll be rebooting make sure your battery percent is above 75 Remember, you should be having the S4 drivers, uh, which will be available in the guys. Now, for the working of Play Store, uh, if this Play Store doesn't work, you will be getting a force close from that. So, go to settings. If you get only, if you only get that force close, uh, you should be doing this. If not don't follow this uh, the video if that place or error does not come for you yeah you are good uh, now if the play store closes suddenly you just need to go to settings sorry more application manager all and search for Google Play Store. Is that yeah? It should be somewhere in here. Yeah, it's there. Click here, uninstall updates, and uh, click OK. Not me. Uh, click OK and you'll be get uninstall that and 
once again click on that uh, you'll be getting it fine that's it that's it for this video please subscribe comment mm, feel free to ask me questions and I'll be helping you very much